All right, how did we format it? Oops. Okay, so it's a stackable uh, thing. Where are you? A stackable hyper tube. We just need one. And then we'll put it over there. And it'll be a long way up, but it should be worth it. Okay, put the hyper tube from here to here. Then we need to put it somewhere. Oh, we also need to bring up the power. How should we do this? There's a power line. Okay, we'll connect this here. But we should also make a jump pad. Maybe like right here. And just vertically. There we go. So we have three ways to access the fourth floor now. Well, I guess not yet. Still need to move this over here. Uh, this needs an entrance, and let's connect this up. I'm putting these power poles over here because we're going to need them eventually, and I don't really want to reconfigure them. Alright, so let's go down. Hmm. Is there something up there? Uh, probably is, but I don't feel like going down up there. Now then, I'm going to add hyper tubes in this direction. here. Oh, we need an entrance first. And there we go. Access to the fourth floor. Easy. Alright, so let's build out some more of these foundations first before we move on. After all, we do need a place to build stuff. So we'll just cut across here and then fill it in.
Okay, that should be good enough for the time being. I just want to check the ingredients now. We'll definitely need a manufacturer and I need plastic. Can I just take plastic from over here somewhere? And one of you has to be making circuit boards. And it's you. And I have to get back up there. Oh, let's check it. Okay, so I can make two of these. Let's just check this out first. And then see what it is we need to bring up here. Okay, so we need both of these. So the modular engine requires two motors, 15 rubber, two smart plating. Okay then. And what about the other one? Let's just build the other one right next to it. And then the adaptive control unit, 15 automated wiring, 10 circuit boards. Okay, so we need to create circuit boards again. Because I don't think we can tap into our existing ones, not without messing up the production of the other products. Of computers, I should say. Two heavy modular frames and two computers. So this will take our computers and heavy modular frames, those advanced materials that we are making. So I say we work on this first. Modular engines. This is the easiest. So we bring the smart plating up. While we're bringing the smart plating up, we might as well bring the automated wiring up as well. Which means we fill out the foundations over here. And then from the second floor, I believe we'll bring those materials up to the fourth floor. Uh, two more, it looks like. Yeah, we can start cutting across this way. But for now... Okay, so these are our products. Now we gotta be careful here. Probably should put it off to the side, maybe like right here. And we'll just give it some room. Okay, let's go down to the Oh shit, 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 shit. Wow. That is dangerous. So let's have some of these nuts. <laughs> I almost died. Anyway, we need automated wiring and smart plating. There's wiring and there's a smart plating. Let's put a lift over here. And then let's sneak in a splitter. Okay, so there's smart plating here and automated wiring over here. So, okay, let's... I guess we can thread it over here. Uh, shit. Wait, hang on. 
let's extend this. I want to see where it is. Okay, let's try to line this up. All right, it's lined up. Let's do the same with this one. Okay, so let's put the automated wiring over here. Conveyor merger or splitter. That's what we need. There's the automated wiring. All right, smart plating going up. We're not exactly using this in the space elevator anymore, so this entire line is pretty much useless. Anyway, let's go back down. Oh, I guess we can get rid of this. We don't need this anymore. Bring this back down. Or what? Oh, what is that? Steel pipes. What happened here? Well, we do need to power this up again. Unless we forgot to put in one of these things, the uh entrances. Yeah, we did. Like, what happened here? I don't remember this happening. Let's just go down. And the fourth floor is this one. Man, this is so convenient. So anyway, let's continue filling out these foundations. Might as well fill out these foundations on our way here. Okay, so we have the smart plating and the automated wiring. Um, we need, if I remember correctly, we need rubber and motors. Since motors are somewhere over there and the rubber is coming up from uh, that area over there, I think we should bring the... I forget which one it is. But we'll bring it through here and over here. Over and around. So it's motors, rubber, and smart plating. That's what we're looking for. Alright, so let's begin or let's continue filling out these foundations. Okay, the smart plating is over here.
You know what? Let's do this. Wait, do it another way. Let's do a little loop de loop action. Not really a loop de loop, but it's. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. So we will bring this up here. Yeah, we'll just do that. And then we'll space it out every three blocks. Yeah, we're still good. I guess we'll stop it right here. Alright, let's bring it over. The conveyor belt... Too steep, what? The hell are you talking about? Oh. We're already placing the conveyor belts, so that's why it turned red. Let's do the same thing in this direction. But we need to get rid of those uh, manufacturers. Okay, once this is connected, we'll go back down and bring up the motors and we'll bring up some rubber. Like we brought rubber onto the third floor, but I don't think we're going to be using it there. Smart plating already here. Now, this is the motors, or no, it's in the second floor. So, I guess we have to drop down here. Oh, wait, that's industrial encased industrial beams. These are motors. Yeah, these are motors and we have to bring them up this way. So it's feeding into the... Let's get rid of this and we'll bring the motors up through there. The splitter can go through here. Hmm.
You know, we probably should go up there and add the conveyors. So the conveyor belt will go around here underneath the steel pipes and then up a conveyor lift that's like right here. Yeah, this will work. That looks about right for the height of this. Oh, this looks awkward, but whatever. Alright, so motors are going up to the fourth floor. Let's double check this. Yes, it is. It's connected. Now, last, we need to bring rubber up. You know, I highly doubt we're going to be using rubber on this floor, so let's just reconfigure the rubber over here. Back up to the fourth floor. I'm thinking maybe I should put some hyper tubes in that corner over there. Just so I have faster access to of these other floors from the other side. Oh, shit. I didn't build all the way over here. This looks tall enough. Let's build some more foundations in this direction. Oh, damn it. Let's try this again. Be careful because I could probably die if I fall from here. And there we go. Except it's not connected, is it? Okay, heal up again. Yeah, let's just do this. Let's like build hyper tubes all the way up here. A stackable hyper tube can go right here. Okay, let's put an entrance here. And let's get down. Without taking damage, or much damage. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's what happened. That's supposed to connect there. Oh, you know what? 
We need to get rid of this rock. Nice. Okay, so what I want to do is place four stackable hyper tubes over here. Put stackable hyper tubes over here. This will be on the fourth and third floor, respectively. And then when we connect the second and first floor, or we can't connect the first floor. We're on the first floor. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with me? Okay, so that here and then we will add where are you again transportation stackable hyper tube or no we'll just do this Fourth floor over here. And maybe the third floor over here. Oh, we need to put the entrances. And we're missing rotors. Alright then. Let's get some rotors. They're on the second floor. Or, are they in this thing? No. Alright, up to the second floor gets another stack of rotors. Yeah, it's over here. We're not exactly storing these. Let's get back over here. And then we can continue our construction once we set up those hyper tubes. I guess we only need to set up the fourth floor for the time being. The entrance here, here, and here. Are these turned on? I guess not. Okay, now they're turned on. Loops around and goes up to the fourth floor. And we can continue from here. Oh. Probably should. the conveyor belt here. Okay, so where's the rubber? Oh, not here. Where'd you go? It's this one right here. Then we'll go up. And then break... Shit. Okay, you know what? Let's just build the foundations this way so we can see what we're doing. Let 
Okay, let's try this again. Oh, what the hell? Are you serious? You can't reach all the way up here. All right. Let's try something else. Oh, the rubber's over here. Bring up a little bit. Let's go up here and then we'll attach another conveyor lift over there. 